Buongiorno! Hello guys, welcome to a new video. Remember Brad Pitt in Glorious Bastards? Well, he was trying to be Italian. <laughs> what does he want to know about Italian people, huh? Anyway, welcome to a new video. You might wonder what these things are on my desk. These are photographic negatives, glass plates from the 1900. Probably late 1800, beginning of 19. If you haven't seen my latest videos, go and check this one here. It was pretty cool and quite emotional for me because I found in the past weeks my great grand uncle photographic studio from the beginning of 1900. I found a few machines. I haven't found the photo camera he was using, unfortunately, but I found a magnifier of this glass plates and I found hundreds of these boxes full of negatives from that time. So what I want to do from today is to launch a vlog which I'm gonna do maybe once a week where we open together one of these boxes randomly and we just go back in time. It's gonna be special for me because it's part of my family and also because it's part of my local history so we might find out really interesting things about the past which is great. I love this kind of adventures and exploring, so I can't wait to get started and we do it right now. What I want to do today is to choose one of these boxes for now, then I'm going to catalog them so we are not going to repeat the same box maybe in the next vlogs. So it's going to be fun, it's going to be exciting and uh, which one should I pick today? I'm going to go for this. So what we're going to do, I'm going to open it up, together we're going to scroll through the negatives quickly, then I'm going to put the negatives in front of a bright white background, I'm going to take a photo of each negative and we're gonna import it into Photoshop, turn it into positive, and that's when the photos really come to life and we can pick one and color it. We're going to leave this together in the same time and open up a box which hasn't been opened in a hundred years. How cool is that? I'm, I'm so excited, let's go. I set up a few things on my desk, my laptop with a white background, so we're gonna place the negative in front of the white background and we can see through the negative and start understanding what happened in this box. And also there's a GoPro here for you guys so you can see live with me what's in the negative as well. Okay, so these are still wrapped up. When you still have some paper around the negatives, it means the glass plates are brand new. These are not actually negatives, but they're just glass plates ready to be turned into negatives and to be imprinted with light. So I'm not gonna open them because I don't want to damage the glass plates because if you have an old camera, you can probably still use them. So yep, wrong box. That can prove I'm doing this with you. I never opened these boxes before. So I'm gonna put it on the side, which is still very exciting because uh, we've got brand new glasses, 115 years old. Okay, you know what? We're gonna go for the big boxes then. I really like that one, it's pretty heavy. These are very heavy boxes. These glass plates, whoo! Carta sensibilizzata. Sensitive paper, that's what it means. These are, the dimension is 13 by 18 centimeters and they were working with silver I'm not sure in English, but they're kind of jelly plates with silver. So I might need to do some research and really find out the photographic method they were using. Okay, so let's open it up here in front of you, actually. This is gonna be a big one. Does it fit inside a GoPro? Okay, box come off. And okay, I'm gonna move it now from here and we're gonna take one by one. These are a lot of negatives and let's find out what's in there. Ready? So first one. Oh, there's two, two little girls. I have no idea who the, these people are, by the way. It's quite strange and uh, yeah, emotional to know these people are not on this world anymore, probably, because yeah, probably not. Second negative, that's a lady, you can see the, the dress already and the hairstyle as well, 
Wow, look at the background, the photographic background. I can't wait to turn them into positive and see how they turn into. Then third one, I tried to keep the same order as well. So I like to keep it as the last person that touched them. Why not? Some respect. These are the two uh, girls of before, I guess. Wow, it's so cool. Wow, I can still see fingerprints on, on the plate. You can probably see it here. And we got two ladies. Wow, look at the dress, the furniture. Everything just brings you back in time. And I put it as it was. Okay, let's see the other one. There are not many negatives actually, it's, they're just heavy. Oh wow, check this gentleman here. Ha! Love the moustache. Granddad, whoever you are. Nice. It's very interesting also because I'm learning about the real photography. This is the history of photography, guys. Just when the photography was starting. And you will see from this plate now a different method of photography because the plate just changed. It has a different color. This building looks like a castle. Probably somewhere around this area, which I might recognize. And these are pretty big negatives. And again, another town, the same building here, the castle. Wow, this is so cool. I'm afraid to break them as well. Yeah, countryside and the town over there with the same castle. Probably it was his house. I'm not sure about that building actually. And again, the castle here. Yeah, trees, that looks like the same as before. And once again, castle. And then we have the last one. Same, but I oh know that's a different building in portrait mode. Nice, so that's what we found in this box. And uh, the process, as you might have seen in my previous video, is to place the glass in front of the screen, the white screen. I'm gonna take a photo for each negative, import the files into Photoshop and turn them into positives. So I'm gonna take the photos now. I will see you in a few seconds with the files ready. Here I am in Photoshop and I've already imported the negatives that you can see laid out down here. Now, some of them are very overexposed for some reason. Probably my black magic is overexposing the photos. Actually, it does, a couple of stops. So what I'm gonna do now is just open the pictures, all of them, so I select all of them. I've got a few, maybe 10 open up and then we're gonna modify quickly one by one and we're gonna pick one to color. Let's start from the first one. There it is, I'm going to modify them, rotate them and change the exposure. But first of all, let's invert the channels, which means we're gonna turn ne the negative into positive simply by pressing Command I on the keyboard. That's my picture and that's so cool. Okay, let's rotate it. I'm going to adjust it so you can see better because you have to choose your favorite at the end of the vlog. So what I'm going to do is to use the camera roll filter. Picture one, remember, because we, you need to choose. So take note, that's picture number one. Then we've got picture number two, that's definitely overexposed. So that's your picture number two. Bada bing. Picture number three. Somewhere there. Number four. It's not too bad. That's your picture number four. Okay, crop it and let's go to five. But that's your picture number five. Mumble number five. Six. Invert it. Okay, number six, you can see the negative here was damaged or burned. Seven, 
Still the castle, I can see it. Wow. So much fun. Okay, 14. Let me know, guys, if you like these vlogs, because I'm going to do more. I mean, I'm going to do it anyway, because I love it. So <laughs> let's rotate this image first. That's your number eight. My fave. And we got nine. Oh, the cuties. Oh my gosh. That was your number nine, guys. We might color this instead. Oh. And then we have number 10. Oh, the lady here. So let's rotate it first. Image rotation, we go. I like the composition as well. This guy was good. So that's your number 10, guys. Which one is your favorite? Comment down here below. Shall we do the two little girls? Let's do that. Okay, I'm gonna get into it and I show you the process in fast forward. And I'm done coloring the photo, so what do you think? Remember I was? The negative? There it is. And that's how it looks with the color. So we brought those two ladies in 2021, 120 years later i hope you enjoyed this vlog once again let me know if you do because i'm gonna do more and i'm so excited to check all these little boxes and go back in time don't forget to let me know which is your favorite photo down here from 1 to 10. if you want to learn anything about content creation and enhance your skills with the adobe softwares photoshop lightroom video editing adobe premiere filming and photography let me know again in the comment tabs but also go and check my online courses at mamoair.com slash courses you will find the same courses also on udemy but on my website they will be cheaper for you so i will encourage you to go and enroll there i thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video so hit the subscribe button